Hello all, welcome to this session. In this session, I'm going to answer software testing interview question 301. That is, what is vulnerability assessment? Let me answer. So what is vulnerability assessment? As part of security testing, we may be asked to perform either vulnerability assessment or a combination of vulnerability assessment and penetration testing, okay? So in some projects, we only do vulnerability assessment without penetration testing. But if the client has given you the permission for penetration testing, along with the vulnerability assessment, we'll also perform penetration testing as part of security testing. Okay, under security testing, we perform both vulnerability and penetration based on the client requirements and all. But what exactly is vulnerability assessment? Let me take an example. Okay, let's say there is a house, okay, your friend's house, and, and uh, the friend has gone out, and uh, the door is there, okay? The entrance door is there, which is uh, which is not locked by your friend, okay? Which is not locked by your friend. So you detected the problem as a neighbor of your friend. You have seen the friend door of that house of your friend and seen that the friend door is not locked. Somehow your friend has forgot to lock it. So when the friend come back, you are informing the your friend saying that, you see, your friend door is locked, uh, is not locked, okay? Uh, you went out by forgetting you were locking your friend door, okay? So there was a possibility of uh, risk that any robber may have entered into your house and has steal your something, okay? But here, you didn't went inside the house, okay? You are just informing your friend stating that you went in a hurry outside and uh, when you are going outside, you forgot to lock, and that's what is vulnerability assessment is detecting the problem and informing to the client that there is a problem in the application is vulnerability assessment which type of problem security problem okay in the application say in the application a kind of security problem is there if you are informing the client that there is a security problem in the application that is vulnerability assessment okay but how vulnerability assessment is different from penetration testing in penetration testing, we should behave like a hacker, the one who intrudes or breaches or does something, okay, steals or something, right? So in vulnerability assessment, we are only identifying the problem. But in penetration testing, we have to show the client that if this problem persists in the application, what kind of damage it can make to the application, how the hacker can hack your application or breach your data, what will happen, how the hacker may damage your delete your complete database or uh, extract all the data of the information of the users in your account. All this stuff you can show. You can go inside and do that. To replicate or simulate the hacker, What's, what the hacker can do, you are showing the picture in penetration testing. Vulnerable to assessment, you are not showing the picture. You're just identifying the problem and in, informing the client that there is a problem, okay? To be fixed. What will happen if the problem is not fixed? It's none of your business in vulnerable to assessment. But in penetration testing, you have to identify the problem, not only identify the problem, and also you have to show the consequences of the problem. What will happen if you don't fix the problem? You have to show. You have to simulate or put yourself in the shoes of the hacker and show the client that this is what is going to happen tomorrow, okay? So if I take that real world example of your friend, okay, uh, who has forgot to lock his house, friend or house, uh, friend or room of the house, and he went house in a hurry. Here, you identify the problem. As part of penetration testing, what you will do is, you will go inside his house, guys. Okay, you will open the door, go inside the house, and uh, uh, you will you will actually steal all the information like a real robber does. Like that, you will you will collect all the items that uh, a robber can do, and you go to your home. And after going home, you will call your friend saying that uh, is your house robbed? Yes. Your friend will say yes. So uh, I am the person who robbed your house. I want to show that what will happen if a real robber will come and steal the things in your house, okay? Next time, don't forget to lock your house. Come to my home and collect your items. Okay, that is penetration testing, okay? So, hope you are able to get the point, okay? I'll give a small demo of the application also, uh, where vulnerability assessment. I'm not going to demonstrate what penetration testing in this example, but I'll, I'll demonstrate vulnerability assessment, how it can be done on the application. For example, this application, sample application is, which is given here, testphp.oneweb.com, okay? What the hacker will do is, uh, uh, if you are, if if as a soft uh, security tester, if you are 
performing only vulnerability assessment and you are not allowed to perform penetration testing then what you will do is let's say on this application i'll go to browse artists and i i got three artists i'll select one of the artists guys when i select one of the artists to see whether there is a security loophole in the application or not here in place of one i'll remove one and put a single quote here okay in place of one as a okay as a security tester i'm putting single quote and press enter and now what is the result you got when you put single quote and search it here browse it here you got some message from the database saying that mysql your data database is using mysql okay rtbms software which array expects parameter 1 to be resource boolean given in some line 62 so some information it is giving to the hacker with this information hacker can penetrate if required okay but here as a security tester your job is only to identify the problem in the application that you see you should not get this kind of messages when you put single quote here okay now when i put single quote i am getting the uh, i am getting a uh, kind of uh, uh, kind of result saying that uh, database message is coming guys it should not come a proper warning message should come single quote is not allowed should come but a, a warning from direct from the database is coming this shows that there is a security loophole uh, that is a security defect you can loophole or vulnerability you can call or it is a security defect you can call whatever it is it proves that there is security defect you identified the defect but you are not utilizing the defect okay you are not simulating the hacker like what if uh, this uh, loophole is there what can be done you are not utilizing okay here you will simply report a defect to the client saying that there is security loophole uh, mysql injection security loophole in the application and uh, you will you will you will uh, write down the steps when i put single quote here i am getting this direct warning from database saying that so this proves that there is a security loophole like that you will insist okay this is what is vulnerability assessment okay we will not penetrate here we will just identify and inform the client that there is a possibility of sql injection in the application okay so hope guys you understood what is vulnerability assessment and how it is part of the security testing in this session so that's all for this session in the next session i am going to answer another software testing interview question for you till then see you bye bye